Well, it's kind of dark here, but I think we can be able to be seated anyways. Wish I like them here. We're here towards the light. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, well, you can hear my voice. You can't see my face as much. Um, what if I did this? There. Yeah, we'll be seeing it a little bit more. Well, we just got out of the uh, meeting with the nutrition-ish portion of this uh, weight loss program. Um, we just spent three hours here. I feel like we just got out of a timeshare meeting or something, the way it went. Uh, this was more an informational uh, meeting. Um, we met with the main doctor, saw her little thing. Um, she had her gallbladder removed at age 30 because she was already overweight uh, from a teenage on. Um, and because of multiple health issues, and she went on to weight loss, whatever. Um, she's a family physician, um, knew that multiple patients had multiple problems, very similar to what she had. She eventually went on to specialize in weight loss uh, health issues. Um, there's also a uh, diet component to this that you don't necessarily have to do but it's an option and it is offered and just like Jenny Craig or any of the rest of them the foods are mighty expensive and um, not necessarily sure that that's going to be an affordable um, thought for us um, we do have an appointment on October something towards the end of the month um, that uh, we're going to be meeting with a, another healthcare, I guess she's a nurse practitioner, um, to talk about the medical aspects of this whole weight loss program. Still don't know that this is the right thing for us, um, but we're going to be exploring the food addiction portions and all of that. Um, my main concern is, yeah, we need to do this, but... Is it going to be affordable? Um, I don't know if you have any thoughts. Well, the, definitely the, the food diet that they offer you, which is totally optional, is not affordable. We are figuring for us it would start at $40 a day plus $30 a week to order the food. And that's around, what, two ninety five or three ten dollars depending on if we get yeah, to and then, and, the, and it's 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 like a total protein replacement high protein she oh, says nice. they put it as a, a a more efficient protein so um well, it's it's not animal fat protein it's some other type of pure protein that they talked about yeah, it's it like being it's supposed to be a 95 percent um, like if you ate a steak you'd only absorb 70 percent of the protein and then you know, it's not even including the hamburgers, the eggs, all those other things that you would be buying. Yeah, because you still have to get, not only do you eating their food and their vitamins and all of that, which is mandatory, um, but you also have to buy all these other vegetables. Um, and I find just with the standard diet that buying vegetables every single day for what you're going to be eating is rather pricey in itself. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, and I didn't like uh, their choices for, for vegetables like turnip, french fries. I mean, no. <laughs> I think I could eat that. But that's it. once again, that's my problem. I love cucumbers. You know, you complain. Well, cucumbers would be you, fine. You, well, you complain in your video about, you know, you know, eating too many cucumbers that you've never had a problem with that. But, yeah, <laughs> you know, I, I love cucumbers. But one of the things that when I went through when I was in Weight Watchers was that I could eat salad all day long until I was green in the face, literally, and they told me that's still no good for me. Um, I overeat no matter what it is. Um, you know, I said in my video, you know, I, I didn't, I don't eat because I'm hungry. I, I enjoy eating, and it's something I do. I do it out of boredom. I do it out of depression. I do it out of happiness. I do it out of entertainment. I do it. It's a problem that I'm having with, and I'm hoping that um, the medical aspect will address that. And as we go here you know and i think that if our problem was just like she said just the weight management itself that you know that that diet might have helped or something but that's not our problem yeah. i think we can do it with regular foods but we 
we need we have other problems in weight management we have true food addictions yeah, and that so. we have to deal with those and like i said i don't know if this place is going to be the solution but not doing anything is not going to be a, a solution. solution so yeah. Uh, we'll see where the it goes doctor to. doctor herself sounded like she made sense, mm -hmm. you know? But and like I said, the next step at this point is talking to the nurse practitioner, and then we'll see where it goes from there. Yep. So, yep. All right. Uh, yeah.